All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Online, where uh, we are going to be continuing this Bloodthorn plot mission. So, if I call my horse and carry on, I think we'll head over towards that quest marker. And yeah, we're back on the island of Bret Bretnik, I believe is what it's called, and uh, where the orcs currently currently control it. And Captain Colleen is trying to help get them into the Covenant, which you know would be good. It would be nice to have a little extra support for the glorious Covenant in our fight in Cyrodiil and our fight with the uh, over the rest of Tamriel. But yes. I guess first we need to help them solve this whole uh, Bloodthorn plot, which I guess this way is probably the best to go. Ah, yes, the graveyard. I I remember it. Lots of things to kill. Oh, hello, thing that can't seem to attack me on my horse. Lovely. Oh, what a sky shard. Yay. Off the horse. There we go. Gotta love the sky shards. All right, so now uh, Grim Field is where we are currently investigating, and that's where we're at. So I guess we just need to head into this crypt here. Good times, good times. Hi, zombie thing. I guess I'll attack it, or it'll run away. Eh, I can live with that. Okay, so you must help us. yes, okay. Hi, f uh, yes. Hello, ghost. You are not a cultist. Help us defeat these necromancers. Oh, but I have a soft spot for necromancers. I always love them in video games. A potent weapon against undead. Okay. Must first charge the staff. Okay, so how do I charge the staff? Employ dark magic. Ooh, dark magic's fun. I use dark magic too. And release that energy. Y yeah. The staff of RK will convert this into Oh, I guess I'll stop them. Let's roll. Aww. I like necromancers, though. Okay, let's pick up the staff of RK. And... Oh. Oh! Hi! Okay, so... Our good old friend Larissa. What are you doing here? Okay, yeah. Alright. Oh, that would be good to have the zombies leave me alone. you're playing with your staff. If I find any more robes, I'll leave them for you. No, thanks. Though, eh, to heck with it. I'll just keep the robe off. I mean, fighting's fun. So... Alright, we're on... Unearthing the past. Let's gather... Or what, what is it? Gather motes to charge. Alright. How, how, do, how do I do that? Oh. I actually don't remember this quest. I haven't done it in ages. Let's see. Oh, I'm guessing this has something to do with it. No? No? Yeah, I'm really not remembering this quest. And there's a lot of other people running around, so hopefully someone knows what's happening. I'm going to go over here and attack this necromancer. I think that's a good plan. Oh yes, kill cultists and collect energy motes or mots. That's what the quest text actually says. So there we go. That's one. See, it'd be good to, uh, you know, actually read what quests say every now and then. All right. So I collected that. Oh, and another. All right, works for me. So let's go find some more necromancers to kill. You're not a necromancer. Hmm. A lot of players around here, so this might actually take a bit. Aha! There's one. And take that. And then that. You you are pretty easy to kill. Yes, take the energy mount. Oh, there's another. So that's good. Looks like we can get two per necromancer we kill. Though personally, I'd rather be uh, a necromancer myself. I wish they had some more necromantic powers in this game, but oh well, uh, the whole, you know, 
People in El the Elder Scrolls universe not really caring much for necromancy. Such a shame. It's such a fun, fun way to fight. Ever since I played Diablo 2 years ago, I've always loved playing a necromancer in video games. It's just... It's just so much fun. But, oh well. I have my, uh... Conjure that I can do, which I actually completely forgot. So, there we go. My lovely clan fear. So let's talk to her again. Okay, so what do I do with it? Ah, alright, so I gotta kill some mini-bosses. Lovely. Ah, uh, this way. Alright. So just should be up here. <laughs> Looks like everyone else is waiting for it, too. Uh, got someone playing the loot. Okay. Hmm. Oh, oh, back up out of the Abomination of Hate already. Uh, okay, so I'm guessing this might be broken right now. Oh, oh, I do remember this quest now. The same thing happened last time I played it in beta. It, uh, seems to not like things. Well. Interesting. I don't remember what I had to do about it. I think I just had to keep coming back to it, but let's go to another one. Hopefully the uh, staff of RK... Oh, oh, well, one of the people is there. So let's just destroy... Alright, so we killed that one, the Abomination of Fear. Huh. <sighs> Alright, so yeah, that, that one of the Wrath one seems to be broken at the moment, which is sad. Uh, yeah, I, re I, I remember that being broken last time as well. Oh, retrieve the staff. I, oh, so I can't open that one. Oh, hi! Hello! Oh, my clan fear took care of the skeleton. Thanks, buddy! Well... I could just wait for this guy to summon it, hopefully. And he did not. Ah! Oh, oh, we got another person. There we go, it'll summon it for us, so we don't have to wait for the staff. Which is now stuck in the ground over there, I believe. So... <laughs> Alright, I got in a shot on him. Lovely. Good job, Clan Fear. So yeah, all that's left is the glitched Abomination of Hate. Ah! Oh. Ow! Ow! Who hit me? Oh, you're gonna pay. You are gonna pay for that. And... Take that! That worked well. Wow, those people are pulling all sorts of creatures towards them. Alright. Is anyone fixing the... What the? There is some foliage in the air. Huh. So, yeah, everyone waiting here, I'm guessing this one is broken again. Uh, hmm. Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to go and check out the other place, the other part of the Bloodthorn plot. So, we won't be. I don't think we'll be able to finish Investigate Grimfield with this quest broken at the moment, which is sad. But, oh, well. I do, I do hope that they have that fixed for a release, because that, yeah, that, that's that been broken for a while. <laughs> uh, what are you going to do? Let's go get this way shrine up here. And come on, go a little quicker, horse. So it's nice to have a horse with this very cheap Imperial horse that we were able to get on this beta weekend. Which, of course, once the game comes out, I believe this is only... Whoa! Oh, he ran out of stamina. Oh, darn. Uh, once the game does officially come out, it's only available to people who pre-order, I believe, the special edition. Uh, which kind of sucks, but oh well, what are you going to do? And, oh, that backpack's already been looted. Uh, but yeah. Other than that, you'll have to buy an expensive horse later on, which, oh my god, they are expensive. Uh, but it is a mount. Mounts are always expensive in games. Oh man, 17,000 gold for the common horse. That's just painful. <laughs> uh, it's like I said in a previous episode, with uh, 20 different characters I've made throughout the beta weekends, I've only able to get horses on, I believe, two of them. <laughs> the rest? Nope. Ooh, spiders. That one didn't aggro, did it? 
Oh, one of them did. Clan Fear's going at him. Take him out, Clan Fear. And there we go. All right, he was pretty easy to take down, and I believe he had some iron greaves on him. I wonder if that's better than my stuff. All right, so more is Sully. That's where we're at now. Let's check out those iron greaves. Hmm. Oh, it sells to merchants for more, and mine are better stat-wise because I've got that uh, increased experience. So, hi. How are you, Azlaka? Are they? No. Oh. What a shame. Is there anything I can do? Oh, Naramo. Good old, my good old Naramo. Always liked him. So where can I find him? Ah, I'll go see if I can aid him. Goodbye. Let's roll. So let's uh, make that the quest now. No, J. All right, Tormented Souls. Let's go and chat with Naramo. So yeah, it was disappointing about that other quest, but oh well, c'est la vie. No, they don't. All right, so Naramo should be up there. Let's just get to him. Looks like some old Elliot ruins. Oh, oh there's good old Naramo. Hi, buddy. How are you? Ah, oh, my old friend. Heard you were here. What's going on? Beyond the Dwemer. Oh yeah. The, the spirits, you say? The ghostly Perhaps we should investigate. The ruin is sealed. Ah, I'm ready. Times, isn't it? I do like to have such a useful yes. tool. Yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Okay, just unseal the door already, Naramo. Let's go inside and take care of some fools. And the way is open. Excellent. Let's just make our way inside here and talk to Targoth's ghost. All right. I'm cool with ghosts. Hi, Targoth. You, you are not one of them. No. You have not one, one of who? Free you from your torment. Who are you and what's going on here? War caller of the stone wolves. Ooh, quite the title. Ah, oh, bloody cultist. How can I help? And how can Drusilla be stopped? Kill her before she can send my soldiers against Will do. I'll find her. How about the orcs a bit? Let's, uh, this way. All right. To the lower chamber. Okay. Come on, my clan fear brethren. Let's roll. Though first loot. Wine grapes. Cap and meat. Oh, and I just got rid of all my cap'n a little while ago. I got uh, another recipe for cap'n noodle soup, which is pretty good. So <laughs> oh my word, there's lots of people here. All right, reach the lower chamber, defeat to Drusilla and Nerva. I don't think that's going to be an issue with how many people are here. Uh, so do we just have to wait for her to respawn? Seems to be the case. Ah, uh, yeah. I have a feeling she's going to die very quickly with all the people around here. So this is, this is still always one of the problems I have with MMOs, and that person is dancing. That's a fun part about MMOs, but the downside, oh, uh, whenever you go to a quest, there's just so many bloody people. There's a monkey. Ha. Huh. Oh yeah, that's supposed to be uh, for beta people. You're supposed to have a monkey. Um, I don't know how to get it, though. I thought we weren't supposed to get the monkey until the game came out officially. Meh. I can live with it. So, is this quest bug, too? I mean... Come on. Oh, I got a E thing here. Oh, that's someone sleeping on the altar. <laughs> Someone playing the loot for us. Do a little ditty. Oh my, don't. Don't tell me this one's bug too. Or does Drusilla just have a very long load time? Or refresh rate, rather. Man, this video is uh not doing too well. Oh, uh, well, there's some people to fight in here, at least. Let's take them down. 
There we go, got a shot in. At least uh, entertain ourselves a little while waiting for Drusilla. Is that a- oh! Per oh, that person's already dead. You are a player. So people are respawning. So perhaps Drusilla will awaken soon. Would be nice. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not having luck on this video, which is kind of kind of sad because I, I unfortunately am running out of time to record this weekend. Uh, it is always a problem with me with beta weekends. I never have any bloody time. But <laughs> uh, so this this actually might be the last video I get of beta footage before the you know the beta weekend ends for me, and I'll just have to stagger these until release. Which is only like two weeks away. And he's gonna die before I get the shot off. Yep. Aha! That one shouldn't though. One shot in on the cultist. Aha! Come on, Drusilla. Wake your lazy butt up. We need to fight you. There's loads of people here waiting. Which means probably everyone will get in one shot. Oh, that person decided to wake up. They're now sitting there in the awe-inspiring aura. A little creepy. Take him down! Ha! Huh. Okay, well, I think we're gonna abandon this one for now, because this quest seems to be bugged too. Well, I guess, you know, it is the point of a beta, and you know, work out the kinks before release. So, we're gonna exit this place and find a small little side quest to do before I end this video, so I don't wanna end it without doing anything. <laughs> So we really haven't. I mean, we we killed a few things, but we really didn't do much. Hmm. Oh, stuck on the corner there. Alrighty. Let's go through. Oh, it wants me to talk to the prophet. I don't want to talk to the prophet right now. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's see. There should be... Oh, that's that quest. Hmm, I'm trying to remember where there were side quests. I think there were some side quests over here, so let's spend the 49 gold and fast travel on over there. And while that's happening, I'm going to take a sip of water. All right. Ah, my clan fear came with me. Uh, side quests? Darn, there aren't any. Oh, man. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I, I have a plan. I have a plan. Let's get on the horse. And... Go to the map. If we head back towards town, I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait, hold on a second. Why was that one 197 gold? Oh, it must have been because I just... Yeah, since I just uh, did a fast travel, it's taking longer now. Let's... Hmm... Which way was town? <laughs> I'm not forgetting. Alright, yeah, let's head. Let's head in this direction. Oh, what the... Ah, My horse is all used up. He just keeps going away. Oh well, what are you gonna do? Let's make our way in this direction then with what little sprint I have. Hello, wolf! You're gonna die. And there we go. Oh, he has summoned some others to help him out. But they they did not last long. Ha. Ah. Always fun. Always fun. It'd be nice to at least find a small little side quest. If I don't find anything soon, I may just have to end the video, which I don't really want to do quite yet, because like I said, this will probably be the last recording I have time for but it might be unavoidable at this point hmm looks like it may be which is sad all right let's uh hmm trying to think of what to do here let's use this way shrine and Go check out... Okay, so we were at that one. We were over there. Hmm. If we head up this way, at least we might be able to find some things to 
do. Ah, need to find something quick. And I'm wondering why my horse is not wanting to do things. I haven't... Hmm. Let's see. Just travel down this way. We could try some crafting, but I have no crafting ability whatsoever. <laughs> uh, well, I take that back. I have actually done a little cooking in this, in this series so far, which I've been avoiding in the past. Do I still have my clan fear with me? Uh, oh, yes, I do, because he's lit up. There he is. There's my buddy. Yeah, let's just go find some things and do a little hunting. Yeah, sure to pass some time. Ooh, is that a rune? Yes, it is a, pr a potency rune. Let's just grab that and that... Oh, that scraping sound. It gets to me every time. Ah. Uh, what is it? I don't know. What is it? Hello, person. Beautiful water. And we've discovered... Karzurg's Demise. Lovely. Alright, looks like there should be some things to do a little fighting, at least, over here. Ooh, we got some uh, ore here, actually. So, yeah, there you go. Mining in the game for if you are a crafting type and you like making your own weapons and armor. Which is fun. I just never really do it that much. Hmm. When the game releases, I really should take on a bit more crafting. Ooh, there's some... Oh, they all did. Okay. That guy took them out pretty quickly. Definitely think I'll get into, like, the alchemy and the, the uh, brewing stuff. I think that that is fun. We'll have to see how that goes. Uh, but metalworking and things like that, yeah, maybe. But probably not, honestly. Wow, there's <laughs> two bugged quests, and now I'm not finding anyone to fight. Aha, there's some people to fight. Yes, finally. I'll just kill some people. Wow, that guy didn't last long. And take a crystal right to the face, and you're down. All right, well, these people are pretty easy. Let's uh, take out this bloodthorn incendiary. You, you are not very strong, are you? No. Ooh, sip of stamina, though. Nice. Always good to find one of those. Knock him down, take him out. Ah, oh, I love that one-two combo. Open up with this, run in with the stabby, and then stab again. Nice clan fear takes some damage for me and does some good attacks as well. Synergy. Okay, good times, good times. This is why I like these uh, sort of mage fighter combos. They are quite fun. Give you a nice versatility. What did that guy get stuck by? Oh, hello. What was... That was interesting. He just kind of disappeared. That was that was strange. Alright. I think while I'm fighting these guys, I, I am gonna... I think I've decided time to end the video with the bugged quests and not a whole lot going on at the moment. Uh, I think it's about that time and well, I've actually got to get back to work, unfortunately. So, yeah, I'm gonna end it here. A little saddened by that fact. Hopefully these uh, these videos, well, this is the last one, so it will have been spread over the course of, like, two weeks or so. Uh, but hopefully you all have enjoyed uh, getting a little bit of a look at some uh, of the Elder Scrolls Online beta. And I hope you guys come and join me once uh, the game does release. Let's do a little fishing while I end this. Throw in some guts. And... Waiting for something to reel in. Look, see, there's fishing and everything. But I, I'm really enjoying this game. I really can't wait until it comes out. Uh, it, it should be fun. I plan on doing... Oh, used bait. Lovely. That's that's not great. I do plan on playing quite a bit. Probably start my own guild in the game, perhaps. Maybe. Haven't decided fully on that, though. But uh, that it is a possibility. But I definitely will be uh, giving it a go. And playing the same sort of... Stuff I am now playing a Breton. I do love the Bretons and I love the Covenant. So, I will be doing that. Haven't decided yet if I am going to stick with this build. It has been very, very fun. I have liked the synergy with my attacks. 
Uh, but I don't know. May may try some other combinations. Don't know what exactly will be my main yet, but uh, getting some good fishing in now. So <laughs> Yeah, I hope you all have enjoyed and that you guys pick up the game too. It it does look like it's gonna be fun. I know I know some people are worried about the subscription fee, but eh Eh, it's not that bad. I mean, come on. Millions of people still pay for WoW. So <laughs> I, I'd say give it a go if uh, if you've got a little bit of money to spare to at least give it a try. Uh, but yeah. I do hope that you come back for my videos I make once the Elder Scrolls Online does officially release. I've got some ideas for some fun ones, both some stuff like I'm doing now and also some possible other little projects. I, I'm trying to work them out exactly, but I would like to do some sort of interesting videos. But yeah, I hope you come back for those and, of course, that you have enjoyed these. Uh, but until that time, thank you for watching, my friends. And as always, have a good one.